This Headless Professor video is about how to use the site dreambank.net. This site will help you find dreams that have been cataloged and actually perform some calculations as to the relative frequency of certain dream content. Let's click on Dream Search Frames version. The first thing we're going to do is select our sample from various groups. So we click on All Info. Now most of these are dreams of specific individuals. What we're going to do is we are going to compare two specific groups that would otherwise be comparable in many ways. For example, let's take a look at Bay Area girls, grades 4 to 6, with slightly older girls in middle school, grades 7 through 9. So, let's select those two groups and click on Search. Now we're going to select a topic to search for in these two groups of dreams. Let's look for dreams about a father figure. This will enable us to come up with a psychoanalytic hypothesis that girls in middle school, closer to puberty, would be more likely to report dreams of their fathers than girls in grade school, grades 4 through 6. So let's select lists, contingency, numbers and let's click search. And immediately we see the results. We see that the dreams of father were more likely in the older girls. 2.6% of them of those dreams reported fathers, but uh, only 1.3 in the younger girls. But this is not going to be a statistically significant difference. Now, if you wanted to save this chart, you could use the snipping tool. So click on those little scissors and surround this chart. You can save it. Girls, father, dreams. And you've saved the chart. That's how it's done. You can even go in and uh, take a look at some specific dreams in uh, many cases. Like, let's click on Show Dreams. Boom. And there it is. You can actually see the entire dream, uh, or at least part of the dream reported that, that pertains to Father. So, that's the way you would do this.